God knows that you've seen enough unboxings of the droid, so we figured we'd do a quick unboxing of the media dock here. Multimedia station. So let's take a peek. Simple. Nice little charger. There's the dock. We also have got a USB cable charge and a big old huge instruction manual which seems kind of gratuitous. Uh, open her up. Slide her down. Very simple. Little Motorola bit there. Nothing on the back. And the USB charger. Uh, to my mind, this really ought to have a 3.5 jack, so you can make it a true multimedia dock and uh, export your audio out to something. But pretty straightforward. And then, of course, we can take our droid and we can set it in the dock. And it recognizes that it's in a dock. It goes to find our location. Yeah. A chance to uh, update the weather there. And I also wanted to load some media on it so you could actually see how the thing works. Uh, so it's pretty slick. You uh, you set it in the dock, and as you saw, it automatically went into this mode. If you want to actually, you know, use the phone, you can um, you can slide the keyboard up if you really want to, and you've got the the whole thing slid up there. Or you know, you can just go back with it. You can hit the home button here to go back to your actual home to you know interact with the phone, and then they put in the notification area this uh, multimedia station icon, which lets you go back to multimedia mode which is pretty slick. It fits in the dock just fine. Of course it would power up if I had it plugged in. Hitting the button over here sort of um, well, it jitters a little bit, which is a little bit aggravating. But that's okay. We'll go back out of that. Okay, so you're in the station mode. You can uh, check the weather. You can see they've got a uh, bunch of different weather coming up for the day which is nice. You can go and start your music. So we'll see what we got here. Play some Ted Leo. It's pretty cool. Turn it down even a little bit so you can hear me talk. Hit the home button. It takes you back to the station instead of to your home, which is actually cool. You've got viewing pictures, and it just sort of jumps into a slideshow automatically. And, you know, I'm a gadget nerd, so the only pictures I have are of gadgets. So there you go. Uh, so that's kind of neat. So you can have a slideshow going while you sleep. You can uh, toggle the brightness to uh, night mode. That's a little bit friendlier if you're, you can see it's pretty dark. It doesn't seem reflected there. Good for the nightstand. And then, of course, you can go jump right into your alarm clock settings. So all in all, the uh, the dock is pretty cool. Like I said, I'm not fond of this wobble over here in the dock. And I'm also not fond of the, the fact that there's not a um, audio out on the back of it. It seems like something they ought to have done. But otherwise, it's uh, it's pretty much fully operational, which is kind of neat.